Hi, everybody. I am Paolo from Evia, the Italian startup that helps farmers take the best decisions. In fact, despite all the advancement in this sector, farmers are still facing challenges that are as old as agriculture itself. Today, they still have to go on the fields every day to hand check the plants. They lack tools to forecast weather conditions and diseases, and they are forced to use more and more chemicals. This is why we created a solution that is hardware and software integrated that makes the fields speak the same language of the farmers. How is it possible? Thanks to sensors, we install the sensors on the fields and the farmer can check in real time what's going on with their cultivations anywhere they are. Plus, thanks to predictive models, they can forecast plant diseases and adverse weather conditions. Also, we suggest them when to irrigate and when to use chemicals, making it the produce healthier. And this is also why this system is a perfect fit for developing countries where resources are scarce and the agronomic know-how is lacking. Our system can work everywhere, even in remote areas where there is no mobile coverage, because we are using the innovative LoRa network. With one antenna, it can cover up 300,000 hectares. Plus, we developed the very first predictive model for lettuce disease in whole Europe. And this is all developed in-house, allowing for more flexibility and scalability. Which are the concrete advantages for a farmer using our system? Let's make an example. Let's pick the most industrialized segment of agriculture, the fourth range. Fourth range are the packaged salads that you buy in the supermarket. Despite being advanced, a farmer is still spending in chemicals every year 4,000 euros per hectare. With our system, we can cut this cost by 10%. Plus, the farmer can be compliant with a global gap, which is a certification of the um, European Union for efficient water consumption. We can make our system work in every kind of cultivation. However, we are starting first from the fourth, uh, fourth range because it's a rising market worth 2.5 billion euros in top four European country only. And if you add the US, this figure is going to double and 3% of the whole cake will be allocated to our system. Plus, this is a sector highly industrialized because farmers are taking care of the whole process from harvesting to packaging. And they also have a very high productive cycle, up to 10 harvests per year. At the moment, in this segment, there are no direct competitors. However, there are companies offering a similar products like ours that may enter this segment. But we are already ahead of them in terms of technology because of our software platform and the LoRa network. A very few companies in Europe are using this network. We are also ahead in terms of forecasting because we are the only one that have a predictive model specific for the fourth range. The way we are dealing with the market is addressing the single farmers directly as well as dealing with the um, third parties working in the segment, like large producers, distributors, and company that take care of the quality assurance of the products. Our business model is based on a pricing of 1,600 euros per one sensor node, covering up to three hectares. After the first year, we ask for a yearly fee of 250 euros. The lifetime value that we estimated is 11,000 euros per customer. 
and our gross margin is 50%. All of this was thanks to an amazing team of experienced professionals. Our CEO, Davide, has international experience at managing startups. Our CTO, Antonio, has spent 15 years designing radars in the whole world. Our CEO, Luciano, a manager from one of the top IT consulting companies in the world. And then there is me. I come from 15 years experience as business manager across Europe. Plus, as you can see, I'm the only one with hair. In addition, we also have a team of specialists. Giovanni, our advisor, with a long-run experience in venture capital. Our agronomist, Marco, working across Europe and the US. Giuliano, the pathologist, one of the most brilliant researchers in the University of Naples. Plus, we have Maurizio and Cicciola helping us with marketing and software development. We can also rely on a solid network of technical, business, and scientific partners. I want just to highlight RWA, which is the largest agriculture company in Austria. And with them, we made our first installation last year in Vienna. We just started to enter the market, and we already got a lot of contact. We are in advanced discussion, both with Fort Range companies and with large companies that have an extended network of farmers in the whole country, like Easy Cementi, one of the largest seed producers in Italy. Aside from ent entering the market, we are also focused on fundraising, and we aim to get 10 customers by the end of the year. Next year, we will have 200 customers, and in 2019, we will be ready to enter the international markets and start selling our product online. In order to do this, we asked for 550K that will be allocated to marketing, product enhancement, and operations. We will succeed because we have the people and the technology to do it. We are ahead of our competitors, marching at full speed towards the conquest of the whole agriculture market. If you wish to join us, come talk with us for more. Thank you. Thank you, Paolo. So, again, let me remind you, there is Twitter for questions. By the way, it appears that, I don't know, whatever that means, we're a trending topic in this moment. <laughs> so actually, big applause, come on. So, Paolo, <clears throat> you, you, you meant, of course, you're focusing on the fourth range, right, market, which is, you know, it's the salad package that you buy at the supermarket. Um, why is it so? What makes so special your solution for that market, and why not other markets? Why don't you go to other markets? Well. We started from this market because of a substantial lack of competitors and because we have the ha hardware and software and algorithms that no one has. So we have a concrete competitive advantage to do that. We can also enter other markets because we can adapt our system to work with every kind of cultivation. And in fact, we are already in discussion with companies that are outside of the fourth range, like wine, oil, tomato. Cool. And I know you're very proud about this, but so these guys have been invited this month to the World Agritech Summit in San Francisco. Why is it so special? Well, is it special because um, this event, they selected 12 startups to present their product to the Silicon Valley investors and companies. And 11 of those startups are from the US and then there is us, the only one. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, Paolo.